Hi, I'm Tony Icono, president for County College of Morris. It's a beautiful spring day and we are at one of our most exciting buildings at CCM, the LHT building. I'm with one of our most exciting professors, Brian Oleksik. Brian, with so many exciting programs at her, horticulture is one that touches many people's lives even if they're not directly involved with it. Can you tell us a little bit about our programs and classes in our horticulture program? Sure, Tony. Uh, New Jersey is the garden state. Uh, we've earned that reputation. People love their gardens. They, they love to work outside. Our program here uh, trains people to be landscape designers, landscape contractors, so that they can actually uh, design and install uh, what you see in front of you. Uh, we're here at the demo garden for our rooftop garden, and uh, this goes hand in hand with our LEED certified building. Um, this demo garden was put in uh, by our landscape construction students. Um, you see many things in bloom right now. Um, we're here on a hot sunny day and everything is just gorgeous. Uh, we're going to take a look in a minute at the uh, rooftop garden which has uh, this type of display on it. So Brian, so much excitement out here. The greenhouses, the model gardens, a lot of great learning every day. But I know you've got excitement on your rooftop as well. How about we take a look and see what's up there? Okay, let's okay. take a look. Terrific. Professor, you've already talked to us about the classes we offer here. Tell us about this building and what makes it unique. Okay, here at CCM we have a focus on sustainability. Um, the college made an investment several years ago to build this beautiful LEED certified building. Uh, LEED stands for uh, Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design. So there's a number of attributes which come with that and we're standing on one of them. So this is the extensive green roof system. A green roof is uh, put in place to essentially keep the heat off the surface of the building. So essentially we've created this surface over the top of the roof which, which is going to cool it off. That way the air conditioning doesn't have to run, run as hard. Um, there's other features. We have the solar panels behind us. Part of what happens on the roof is uh, there's water collection. The water actually after it perks through the roof uh, goes into the cisterns. We have two large cisterns which collect the water which then can be used to water the ground. So we're reusing the water, we're not wasting the water. So everything here really focuses on energy conservation and resource conservation. That's fantastic. We do a lot of eco uh, programs, eco efforts throughout the college and clearly this is really at the front of all of that in terms of how it's been designed and how it functions. So it gives students a lot to learn even beyond horticultural practices. Right, and, and this is the trend. So we're always looking to conserve water, to conserve fertilizer, not to use as many pesticides. We work that into our curriculum. So the building really mirrors what we're offering in the curriculum, which mirrors what's happening in the industry. So everything is tied together. That's outstanding. I'm President Icono here today with one of our standout professors, and I recommend come on out to CCM, find out more about our horticulture program, how you can be a part of it, and how it can support you. Have a great day.